Hello, Gemini. This is Starbright. I'm here to do a spread. How do you feel about your partner? How do you, I'm not going to say partner. How do you feel about your ex? And how your ex is feeling about you and the mutual energy between the both of you guys. This is going to be for September 16, 2020. How are you feeling about your ex and how your part, your ex is feeling about you? I want to say partner. Some of you guys want that part, that ex back. That's why I'm saying partner. I'm, I'm, Some of you guys want them back. Here we go. Spirit of the earth, water, fire in the air. Show me cards I need to see. How is Gemini feeling about their ex? How are they feeling about their ex? And how their ex is feeling about them. How do my ex is feeling about them, Spirit? Show me the cards. How the ex is feeling about them, Spirit? How the ex is feeling about them? And the mutual energy between both of you guys. Hmm. Hmm. Bottom of the deck. Hmm. Now playing this waiting game. Hmm. You're playing the waiting game. All right. How you guys feel about your ex? Hmm. This is someone from your past, or you could have a child with this person. You feel like this person is like have one foot in and one foot out. You see this person as a player, but you see a loving family with this person. You're very indecisive about this person. And you wait for your ships to come in. Yeah. It's someone from your past. You see that person's a player, but you see a loving family with this person. Indecisive. All right. How do your person feel about you? <clears throat> mm, this is someone, they feel like they took a break from you. This person will uh, cut you out of their life. But that person still holding on to you. That person see being with you for a long period of time. Or you could have been with this person for a long period of time. This person thinks about you a lot. Day and night. That person want to balance things out with you. Okay, the mutual energy between both of you guys. <clears throat> both of you guys are feeling remorseful. Both of you guys... Plant a seed with each other. They you, they think about the time, the quality time and energy and money they spend on you. And you think about the same thing about this person. Both of you guys want a romantic proposal. And both of you guys are feeling the repercussions of their actions. Maybe something you had did to this person. Maybe something this person did to you. Both of you guys are feeling the repercussions of your actions. You want a romantic proposal. Both, this is mutual energy. <clears throat> but you want you want that person to uh, you want that person to plant some seed. That person already plant seed with you, but you want that person to grow, continue growing with you. Both of you guys are feeling remorseful. Hmm. Okay. It's like you guys. It's like you. Everything is on hold. It's like this person got you on hold. Hmm. Hmm. Or oh, you putting this relationship on hold because you see this person as very flirty, like to be seen. This person can be married. <clears throat> this is a one to live across the water from you. So some of you guys are making a decision to start something new and fresh with this person. But you feel like this person trying to manipulate you. So this is someone that you want to walk away from this person. But you do see this person as someone grounded. You see this person uh, like nice things around them. But this person had broke your heart. Hmm. Now this person want to rush in and fight for the relationship with you because this person wants some positive change. They want things pos positive changes with you. The person see the sunshine with you. The person see happiness with you. This is someone you had to end with this person. You feeling burdened by this person that wants this victory with you because of an ending that you guys have had. It could be a Capricorn that wants this or somebody's in this energy. 
you see this person very toxic, but this person wants equal give and take. <clears throat> this person see you as an ideal partner. They want to send you a message about they let someone go. They saw this person as a twin flame. This is who they was committed to, this person. They saw this person very nurturing and caring. There was too many fights and arguments and too much drama. That person want to come in and apologize to you because they had a reunion with this person. They want to come in and speak the truth to you about who they was hiding. This is their ex. It could be the, uh, the mother or their kids or someone they was committed to. Or this could be a Taurus. This person will live at a distance from them. This is someone that made a worker. This is someone that was in a third party. This is why your person that ghosts you. Hmm. And this is someone that's not uh, very depressed. This is someone that's not sleeping at night time. This is someone that's holding back from you because of a soulmate. And this is someone that had moved to come waters with this person. So your person that made a final decision about you that they want to pour. They, the final decision is they want to pour all their emotions out to you. They want to move forward with you. And this person want a brand new star with you. But this person is very deceitful. This person trying to control their emotions. Uh, trying to control their emotions because they want this new leaf of faith with you. They want to come in. They want to pour their emotions out. They want to come in and take. Uh, this is someone serious. This is someone that could be very controlling. This person want to take action. This person want to talk because you that person wish. <laughs> this person want to come in and speak the truth to you about someone they saw. Someone um, a very powerful woman, a male. They would try to be patient with this person, but they didn't trust this person. <clears throat> They saw this person as someone who met their feminine to go to life. They saw this person as someone who very abundant, but they had enough of this person. <laughs> and that, per that person betrayed them. They feel like that person backstabbed them. So now they feel left out and cold by someone who's very controlling, by someone who had a big ego. This is someone that was very abundant. So your person made a decision to be with you. If you need a personal reading for me, all the information is down below in the description box. You can be dealing with all signs. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sag, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. If you're new to my channel, hey, until next time.